Hey, what up guys? Welcome to the next installment of Rooting Game Season 8, Episode 7. In this episode, we're going to be playing the new card that we got from the Do This Challenge. And we're going to build a deck around it. So let's check out that, guys. As you can see, we're playing a burn deck. It's not your traditional um, T Garner burn deck. This is a completely different burn deck. We'll be posting focusing on mainly on this card by princess this is the card we get from the do this challenge unfortunately you can only get one copy of this card in this deck um so yeah in this game so i'm only running one copy uh but using draw sense 5 we, we ensure that we can draw into this card so that's why i'm using draw sense 5 really good if you don't have the skill you can use um destiny draw it should work but that you have to take 2000 damage right where i suppose you only take 1500 if you use draw sense fire so this basically what this card does is um, each time you gain life point, you take 500 damage to your opponent, insane powerful. So we have all the cards that help us deal 500 damage to your opponent using like Dan Kato, Problem Thief, so the Pure, and Spell Absorption, and so on and so forth. So yeah, basically pretty much a healing card. So the other card I'm running in this deck is Magical Mana. This I run this card in this deck because um, it makes the deck more consistent, right? Um, because one, you could um, replace this with uh, another healing card instead, but yeah, I am running this card to make this deck consistent. Ideally, you want to use this card to draw into um, Copper Ace. Basically, Copper Ace is what makes this deck um, more consistent because um, if you uh, toss a coin and get ahead, you basically draw two cards, right? This two card will well, is the difference between you winning the duel or not, right? So this card is definitely an ace card in this deck. So I'm running this card in this deck really good. The other card I'm running in this deck is um, Spell Absorption. Basically, this is um, basically a healing card. Basically, if you if you activate Spell card, um, you gain 500 life points. So you want to use this because um, with 5 Princess, um, you can inflict 500 life points damage. Really good, guys. So yeah, this is what I'm running. This one is like the other card running is Own Seal. This is a basic attack card in this deck. Um, if you guys want, you can replace this with um, another healing card. Any healing card should work. Um, the reason I'm running this card is to counter enemy controller take. So you can use this to um, take control of your monster, right? So if your open happen to Econ take, you can take control of your monster to your side of the field again. So yeah, this is a basic attack card, really good. I never actually got a chance to use it, so it's mainly there as a um, like a tech card, right? Basically. So yeah, guys, this is pretty much a deck. Um, yeah, it's definitely a fun deck, guys. So yeah, for those people that hate um, burn deck, this is not the video for you guys. But yeah, so yeah, the cancer's burn deck is back, guys. Better than ever. So yeah, let me show you guys something to do with play with this deck. Show you what this deck is potential of and what. So yeah, as you can tell, um, this deck is still a work in progress. Um, I'm still tinkering and testing this deck, so it's not completely finished yet. If you guys have any suggestions how I can improve this deck, leave a comment section below and I'll take a look at it. Anyway, enjoy the duo play, guys. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be showing you guys um, live duo afterwards, so don't worry about it. I I want to show you guys how consistent this deck is in the live duel so majority of a duel play is going to be um, one turn KO yeah I'm using um, reload so yeah, I've been testing this deck out with uh, other cards like reload, solemn wishes and um, other cards like the different dimension capsule and so on I'm trying to see what cards work really well in this deck so yeah, you want to use summon five princess then procedure, use cup of ace, get two heads, get to draw two cards that will help us deal effect damage to our opponent, activate spell absorption. If you guys not aware, um, spell absorption stacks, so the more spell absorption card you have in your, your, on the field, the better. There we go guys, at this point, all my opponent can do is just watch guys, you can't do anything about it, yo. this deck is so broken yo. We can actually work. Good game. Look at that, guys. 
One turn KO, yo. Oh, we burn our opponent to death. Let me show you guys the second duel play. So you guys, you definitely want to run um, draw sense fire. So you, to help you ensure that you draw into the fire princess. Or you can run um, less than draw like we saying earlier. Benny Keep versus Benny Keep. So with this stack, you want to go second because you get to draw an extra card, right? Came up and running speed start. This is pretty good open hand, guys. Come thief, cup of ace, so scrap his option. Here, my opponent didn't summon any monster. That's okay with us, guys. So you basically um, want to start as much as you can until you get you can draw as many cards you can. So this is what this way did. Here, my opponent attack. I activate draw sun's fire, summon fire princess. Activate um, sub absorption. Use cup of ace. Unfortunately, I didn't get ahead, but it does, doesn't matter. Um, I can still inflict 500 life on damage due to um, spell absorption. So, uh, cup of ace is really good in this deck, guys. Like, it's insanely good. So, I was like one singer, I was running Solemn Wishes before. I'm, I'm testing out to see if this works, but. This card is not that good because um, it's pretty slow. I decided to not use it. As, I'd rather use some um, spell absorption instead. So these matches are very quick and easy, guys. Oops, I accidentally pressed the uh, dual play by accident. Every single time, yo. Oh, never mind. This is the. This is a new duel, right? Yeah, I haven't shown you guys this duel yet, so this is good. Oh, wait, I wish... I have not show you this, right? Yeah, I haven't shown you this, so let's show you guys the third duel with stack, guys. So the majority of my match is gonna be OTK, like... Like, this stack is pretty broken, yo. So I've seen other um, people running a different variant of this stack. All healing cards, but I decided to use Cup of Aids and Magic Matic to make this deck more consistent. And plus, um, I added that Owner Seal for that in case of my opponent use enemy controller, you can take so I could take control of my monster. Here, my opponent playing Phoenix. Like I was saying earlier, I've been testing out different cards. This card um, is good in, in switching out your Fire Princess, but I wouldn't recommend using it because it's pretty slow. Maybe if you use different deck where you don't rely like, heavy on all spell cards, maybe um, like monster cards, this card might be useful. Different Dimension Capsule. This will help you switch out any card on, in your deck, but you gotta wait two standby phase, right? With a uh, Fire Princess, you need to win in one turn because if you don't, then you're gonna lose the next turn because your opponent gonna attack into it and we don't have any cards to stop it, right? So yeah, let the spell absorption do all the work, guys. Activate Magical Mallet. There we go. Oh! My opponent can do is just watch her as I activate all my spell cards and keep getting big damage to my opponent. Good game. Goblin Thief for the win. Look at that, yo. My opponent can't even do anything, yo. All he can do is just watch. Our next two is against Gami Yugi. We went first. Here, surprisingly, I open up with a Fire Princess. This is good. That means I don't need to activate um, Draw Sense Fire. 
so that means I can draw another spell card. Really, that's really good. Here we go, guys. Summon your five princess. Same procedures. Activate spell absorption. Spell all. Your, activate all your spell cards. Here, activate magical matter because I did. I don't have enough damage to deal for the lethal. Here I was hoping I could join to couple base, which I did. So we're gonna deal thousand. Activate couple ace. There we go guys, which I need to 500, good game. So a couple base came clutch for us guys. This is why I'm running cup, cup of base and make this deck more consistent as opposed to all healing cards. So our last duo play is against Mako Tsunami. So guys, yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the live duo afterwards. If your opponent hap does not attack into you, um, it does not matter to keep um, stalling until you get as many cards as you can and then wait till you can um, activate draw sense fire. Here my opponent didn't attack for some reason, I don't know why, but that's good. You get to draw an extra card, that's good for us. Here my opponent finally decided to attack. So yeah, yeah activate draw sense fire, get out my five princess, same procedure, activate. Here, I join to owner seal. This is really good. Just in case my opponent happened to have enemy controller, I could like use it. Here, I decided to keep it in my hand just in case if you happen to have enemy controller. I use magic matter to join to other cards. Activate spell absorption. Now, if you guys not aware, spell absorption stacks, right? They stack, so you could do double the damage. Look at that, yo. Activate Dankato, that's another thousand. Good game here. There we go guys, the power of this deck here, the Cancer's Burn deck is back guys. So guys, enough of the dual play, let me show you guys the live dual this deck. So yeah, I could probably get some of the couple of dive dual in. Don't wanna make this video too long guys, but yeah, I'm, I could do a couple more live duo with this deck this deck is definitely fun that fun deck guys like definitely try it out this deck is not even that expensive like it's mostly uh free to play cards right so this is definitely a free to play friendly facing 30 cards deck interesting and i'll turn What kind of skill this guy is running? Let's pick Umi, so that means he's running with the death. Whoa. Does he open up a, a perfect opening hand? Orca Mega Fortress. Interesting. Okay, we gotta activate skill. Hopefully, he doesn't have any controller, you guys. So one of the weaknesses of this deck, this deck is um, enemy controller. Let's activate fire princess. Let's give enemy controller. Nope. Let's activate spell absorption. Let's activate cup of ace. Yo, give me head. Give me head, yo. Give me head. Give me head. Come on, come on. Hold the card, yo. No man, come on. So literally we're gonna lose guys. So with this set you either win or lose fast. So if we happen to get two more cards, we could have joined to like another couple base and we could have probably won. So he's probably gonna live with a thousand life points though, like pretty unfortunate. There we go, we lose guys. 
basically just surrender at this point. So yeah, a couple of these let us down guys. We didn't get ahead. If we happen to toss ahead, we may have a chance guys. Yeah. So yeah, this deck rely like heavy on the couple of eights. This is why I'm running this card this, in this deck to make it more consistent. If Cup of Ace will happen to be another healing card, we would only be able to um, what, deal um, 500 life, 1000 right? So he's gonna live with what, 500? Okay, this is good, we're going second. So with this deck, I'm gonna go second because we get to draw an extra card. Okay, this is pretty decent open hand guys. So he's running mountain, so that means he's running dragon deck probably. Okay, this is good guys. Play defensive. I mean we get to draw more cards. That's probably Kimoto here. Or Blue Dragon Summer. Hmm. He's not going for attack for some reason. Very strange. Let's um set this. Just in case he happened to use stamp and destruction. Wait, I didn't even need to set yo. Because I have what? One, two, three, four, five. Five cards. I've, yeah, I'm banning the stamp and destruction. Hmm. This person still have an attack for some reason. I don't know why. Very strange. If you achieve something for Blue Eyes Blood Dragon, this is gonna be pretty bad because like, you probably have Champion Vision set in this back, bro. Hmm. Wow. You can only do it. Okay, this is pretty bad guys, like it. We just missed out on 300 damage. So we can activate this, the skill. We need to take 1500 life damage in order to activate the skill. Hopefully he doesn't face up the other two monsters. If he did then... Okay, this is good guys, this is good. We got this, yeah, we got this. That was a pretty risky move because um, he happened to face up the other two monsters. We could have lost. That's like we draw some fire. That's activate fire princess. That's activate spell absorption. Let's activate our second spell absorption. Yo, we got this, yo, we got this. Let's activate Magical Mallet. Let's return this. Should I return the other card? Nah. Do a thousand. Be so pure. Do a thousand. Oh, 1,500. Yeah, this is OP, yo. Look at that, yo. Look at that, all that damage, yo. My opponent can't even do anything, yo. Look at that. So OP, yo. So broken. 
The cancer burn deck is back, yeah. Better than ever. So, hope I could have time for one more deal, guys. Hopefully, I could show you guys another win with this deck. Don't want to make this video too long. So, as you can see, this deck is pretty good. Magical Matter and Copper Wraith make this deck more consistent. That's why I added it. If you guys want, you could um, replace them with any other healing cards. So uh, we didn't go second, that's bad. I did you want to go second with this deck? So this deck is still a work in progress guys. Like I'm still tinkering and testing out other cards. Like I may consider taking out Magical Matter completely and try out other cards like healing cards instead. See if it if it's better or not. Hmm. So a couple ways need to come in clutch for us so let's activate the skill. Let's activate five princess. Come on, give me toss ahead, the toss ahead. Wow. So unlucky, yeah. Let's hope we can join to um second couple ways. Nope. Okay, literally we lost yeah. So with this deck you wanna go second because um you don't get to draw the extra card, right? Yeah, I think I have time for one more, yeah. Let's let's do one more with this deck. So yeah, with this deck you win fast you win fast or lose fast, right? That's the name of the game. You will not be the more from falling ranks. Wait, this is new, right? I never seen this before. You will not be the more from falling ranks. No matter how many times you lose, broke your one, bronze one. Okay, so you got me Yugi here. Let's hope we go second, yo. Wow, we go first every single time. Is this guy the same person? Okay, at least we open up with a fire princess so that we don't have to activate the skill. Owner Seal is basically a dead card. Hmm. Is this game? Yep, this is game. Well, literally, guys, my opponent opened up a perfection. This guy's running 30 cards back, and he managed to. Okay, we're gonna survive. We're gonna survive guys, we're gonna survive with a hundred. Give me head, give me head. There we go. Another head. Look at that, yeah, look at that, yeah. Okay, let's activate this. Give me two heads. Hey guys, so unfortunately the video cut off uh, yet again. So basically what happened after it was um, I managed to toss a, a head again using my third cup of ace. And then basically I just burned my opponent to death. That's basically what happened. I won the match as you can see against Braun. So guys, this deck is insane and broken, yeah. Like once the combo actually worked, it's insane and broken. Like literally, that's why I have a cup of ace in this deck. It made this deck go cool, right, so that's why I'm running it. So let's check out the deckers again and see what changes I would make. So some of the changes I would definitely make is um I would consider taking out Magic Matter for more healing cards and maybe take out Owner Seal for another healing card like or Restructuring Revolution it should work. So guys, yeah, this is pretty much the deck. This is the card the the deck revolve around. Find Princess. Unfortunately, we can only get one copy of this card in this deck. I'm not sure how broken this would this, this card would be if we have three copy. So guys, draw sense five will make this um one card not that uh, much of a problem because you get to draw from your deck right using draw sense fire. So 
One card is fine. One copy is fine. So yeah, this is pretty much the deck. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So guys, the cancerous burn deck is back. Powerful than ever. So guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you guys want to see similar videos like this, subscribe to my channel. I always try to bring out similar videos like this whenever I can. So guys, I'm not sure what kind of deck I want to bring out for the next episode. Um, I'll figure it out. So guys, yeah, thank you for watching. Until next time, peace out, yo. I believe the update is tomorrow, right? The Dark Tower update. So guys, enjoy the event. Until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video later.